quick shout out to all the fruitarians on Snapchat. Show me love every day. You guys are ridiculous, man. I love you. Just going for a little walkie walk. Get rid of the spider webs. You know you're the first one walking the trail when there's tons of spider webs in front of you. It's kind of like when you're a snowboarder or a skier and you're on the mountain and there's like fresh powder, you know you're the first one there. It's like that in the summer too with spider webs on the mountains. All right, so the, uh, you can tell by the title of this video, I'm gonna talk about the three most attractive character, character traits. Your most attractive uh, ways a person can be. This is for any sex, male or female, or those who don't identify. If any human exhibits these traits, you're gonna be much more attractive to everyone, especially to me. Especially to me. The first one is, and, and perhaps some people don't appreciate these traits, but I, I really appreciate these traits. I, I look for these traits in people, and when I see them, they stand out. The first one is being considerate. A considerate person is so nice, man. So nice. When someone puts like a, a little extra thought into something for you or for someone else, it's just really attractive. Being considerate. It's like if someone's sleeping, shh. If uh, you know somebody doesn't like bananas, take the bananas out. Or if uh, you know someone really likes the color yellow or something, go out of your way to get the yellow book or pencil or whatever it is for them. Like just the extra little thought, being considerate about people. Or if you're making dinner and you know someone else hasn't eaten, maybe offer them dinner at least or make it for them without even asking. Who knows? Just be considerate of other people. Think of others. Okay? So that's the first trait. The second one is self-awareness. When someone's got self-awareness, they know what they're good at, they know what they're not good at, they know what they like, they know what they don't like. That's really cool, that's really attractive. When someone knows what they want. And when they know where they're going too, that's even, that's even next level attractiveness. When someone knows where they're going. Very attractive. And with self-awareness, it in a way it's, it kind of contradicts consideration for other people. Because when you're considerate, you're thinking of others, but when you're self-aware, you're, you're, you're so sure of yourself, you're so sure of what you're doing, at least in that, in that moment, and you're so sure of how, how you can uh, live your life in a way that makes you feel good. You also, you're so unique and you don't care what other people think of you. You just don't care what other people think of you. So you're, you're just you, you're unique. You're like, almost like brandable, like you're, you're your own brand, your own entity, you're your own like hybrid combination of all these things that led you up to where you are today as a person. And you're okay with that, you're open about that. You don't care what other people think, you dress the way you wanna dress, you speak the way you wanna speak, and you just, you just be you, you do you. That's very attractive. The third most attractive character trait someone can exhibit, exude, is the uh, the way of being agreeable. Just be agreeable. Doesn't mean you have to necessarily agree on everything that's said or everything that's done, but when someone conducts themselves in a way that makes them agreeable, they agree to disagree without saying agree to disagree. They just go with the flow. They just, they, they don't, they don't, they avoid confrontation. They just straight up say like, all right, cool. That's the way you see it. Awesome, you have a unique perspective as well. Because when someone is unique enough to stand on their own and say, hey, you know what, this is who I am, this is what I believe in, and they're considerate of others, then they're gonna be agreeable in that they're gonna be like, all right, other people can believe what they wanna believe and be as they are as well. So it's like accepting of others. Maybe that's another way of saying it. You're an agreeable person, you're just accepting of others. And uh, that doesn't mean you tolerate others, you don't need to tolerate others' behaviors or 
tolerate other people's actions towards you, whatever, but you can at least accept it. Just accept it. Don't reject or deny it, just accept it. See it and just acknowledge it and then learn from that. And be like, okay, cool, that's the contrast in the world. There's always polar opposites, there's always polarity. The only way for there to be a mountain is there for there to be a valley. The only way for there to be an in is there for there to be an out. The only way there's light is because there's dark and vice versa. The only way for there to be life is there for there to be death. So when you have like a strong belief about something like raw veganism is the holy grail of the human diet, which it is, that like man was made for fruit or humans are made for fruit, women are made for fruit, people who don't identify are made for fruit, like you have that strong belief, you also gotta prepare yourself for people who don't believe that. And that's totally fine, man. We're allowed to have our own beliefs, but it's just, as mind-blowing as it may seem that some people think we're designed to eat meat, it's true, some people actually believe that. And it's fair enough, because everything that they experienced in their life led them to reach that point, so whatever. Anyways, those are the three, three most attractive character traits. Maybe not the top three, but they're just three extremely attractive character traits in my eyes. There are other things I could talk about, things that I like in another person. But maybe we'll save that for another video. For now, we enjoy the view.